Good morning, everybody. Happy Saturday morning to you guys. Listen, what's cooking? What's cooking? What's for breakfast today? You know, we have all had a very long and hard week. Uh, this coronavirus is something else. It's, uh, whew, you know, and, um, you know, most of us are working from home and some of us are doing dual duty. We're working from home and then we're going into the office, which is what I do um, once per week. However, you know, I just wanted to wind down today. I wanted to be able to sit down and enjoy a good breakfast without having to rush and just collect my thoughts for the week. So much has been going on and it's so much that I believe God is trying to say and speak to us. And I just wanted to re be able to be in a place where I can hear him today. So this is my little cozy reading nook, which is right inside of my kitchen. Uh, and this is where I come to do my wind down. So today I'm going to call it a wind down Saturday. I'm going to wind down on a Saturday. So I just want to share with you what I prepared for my breakfast on this morning. And, um, I just wanted some real food today. So I cooked me some grits with some cheese. I love grits and cheese. I just love it. Oh my God. It's so good. And my friend, my BFF, my best friend from South Carolina taught me how to cook grits, guys. <laughs> and um, he told me, he showed me how. So what he does is he washes the grits two or three times. He rinses the grits off two or three times to get all the debris out, he says. And then I was brought up where you had to boil the water, but he said, you do not have to boil the water. Just put the water in, put the grits in the cold water with your, with your salt and um, just cook it nice and slow and just keep stirring. And he uses a lot of butter. I prefer cheese, but he just keeps adding that butter and stirring and stirring. And when I tell you he has the creamiest grits you ever want to taste, Thank you, BFF from South Carolina. And then I just decided to make me some eggs, some scrambled some eggs, and I like um, sausage. So I made me some sausage, and then I have some um, cinnamon raisin bagel. And today I am drinking my tea forte, which I'm not sponsored by them yet, but today I'm using chocolate rose. I think last week I gave you the wrong name. I, I don't know what kind of name I gave you, but it was chamomile something. But I used some word. I don't know. But today it is actually chocolate rose. So I'm going to have my hot tea. Look at that. Look at that, Steve. Woo-wee. And I'm going to pour me up some, some tea. And I am going to wind down, guys. I'm just going to wind down. I need it. I know you guys need it, too. But I'm going to wind down today and uh, get my thoughts together. But I just wanted to show you how I do breakfast in my household. And this is breakfast for one. It is breakfast for one. And that's okay. You know. So what I'm going to do is I got, uh, this is my Lazy Susie. I use wooden products. I'm into the wood now, guys, as you can see. And, um, you know, I did a haul on this when I first started YouTube of all my wood products. But uh, this came from Dollar Tree. These plates came from Dollar Tree. Uh, this uh, napkin, these napkins came from Pier 1 and so did these napkin holders. I thought that was a nice whimsical touch there. These, um, and don't, my hands, you know, everybody's hands look bad right now. But these, uh, this silverware, this flatware, it came from Macy's about, who? Ooh, almost 40 years ago and it is time to retire it because I'm noticing that it's getting you know a little worn out and I made a mistake a couple of times and put it in the dishwasher and you should never put them in the dishwasher but um you know so you can mix um uh, high end with low end so the these came from Pier one these came from the Dollar Tree uh the the wooden pieces all of my wooden pieces I think came from home the home store or or home goods I think I mixed and matched them the um the goblet came from the Dollar Tree. And um, so I just want you to see my setup of uh, how it's going down here in my hood. And uh, I'm going to enjoy this breakfast. And I hope you guys are going to have a blessed and marvelous and wonderful day. Be blessed. This is Velvet with Empowering Moments.
Have a great day.